We remember the beautiful memories of our childhood. Few of us always say how beautiful our youth was because we may not have had significant experiences transitioning into adulthood. Everything was so simple. You may not have had any responsibility. The younger ones in the family got a lot of attention from the rest. The adults took care of everything. Although this may be different in some households, everyone's childhood was beautiful, and some children grew up with family struggles. Yet, most of the time, our childhood memories are happy. We like to remember those good old days. In our busy lives, small beautiful memories keep us well. When the responsibilities of life increase as we grow up, we all want to go back to that reassuring time, sometimes, which is very typical. When does this create a problem? It gets alarming when your childhood memories are your constant companion. If the memories appear as the present, you start moving away from your relationships, leading to complex problems like depression. We need to understand that no matter how beautiful childhood memories are, they are a thing of the past. You can't live in the past. Learning from the past is a necessity for the future. We live in the present. Let's plan for the future. Childhood memories are like a photo album to us, which we can see from time to time. We can think, but we can't go back there. A person or your loved one can face challenges dealing with the day-to-day -day because of their childhood memories. If they compare almost everything, every situation with their childhood memories and live with them emotionally, they're experiencing nostalgia depression. Nostalgia is often associated with positive emotions, including a sense of purpose or meaning, social connection, and optimism. However, it can have a downside, an unpleasant aftertaste with a lingering bite. If we get fixated on the past, there is a high possibility that this fixation can later turn into an uncomfortable state of being. You can be dissatisfied with the present if you long for the past. Hence, nostalgic depression is a yearning tainted with hopelessness or despair. Nostalgic depression is not identified as a type of depression by experts or mental health professionals. However, the current situation leads to finding scientific evidence to support it. Aromas and music in particular can evoke nostalgic feelings. Freud realized in 1908 that odors have a close link to emotions. Firstly, this is because the nose is directly connected to the brain's limbic system, where emotions are stored. The amygdala is a part of the limbic system that controls emotions and motivation. A person is more likely to experience intense feelings if odors are directed directly into this part of the brain. The limbic system also contains the hippocampus, which plays a crucial role in memory and emotion. There is a strong likelihood that odors will induce nostalgia since the nose is connected to two brain parts involved in memories and feelings. An individual might experience nostalgia when their nose experiences similar triggers. Second, the problem arises when these triggers make the individual uncomfortable, leading to nostalgic depression. If you are prone to worrying or you constantly find yourself dwelling on dark and unwanted thoughts, your nostalgia might cast a long shadow. Third, not just this, specific nostalgic memories can generate sadness, guilt, and regret, making it a challenge to cope with. According to studies, nostalgia has been negatively linked to well-being when measured in daily life. Lastly, a recent study found that the adverse effects of nostalgia on affective well-being were significantly more potent on days when people felt more alone than when they felt less lonely. On the other hand, the adverse effects of loneliness on affective well-being were more substantial when people felt more nostalgic than when they were feeling less nostalgic. If this kind of problem arises, talk to a psychologist if necessary. Download our app for more details. To know more about the subject log, connect with a therapist or lawyer through the United We Care website or app. Easy access to a host of professionals working just to make happiness your first priority.